Okay, so for this team, I just wanted to use Perry outside of a bleed team. Because Perry, he used to be like really good in bleed teams because he was like the he was the only mechanical pet who could throw out a bleed. And there wasn't really any undead pet, so it was nice to have a really good pet with a racial that could actually throw out a bleed. But for this one I'm using Frying Pan instead. Frying Pan, it, it doesn't hit hard either. He's he's kinda weak. But it it also has a one turn cooldown and it has a 25% chance to send the target every time you hit. So it's not the greatest ability in the world. It doesn't hit hard, it has a round cooldown, and it has a... I mean that mini chance is done, it's not half bad. He also has stench and food coma, so I can put him to sleep and go for some nice switches without my pets taking damage. I can throw out stench, so that way it reduces their chance to hit, and I've had quite a bit of misses with stench out. So with this guy, when he's out, I basically just frying pan and then refresh stench and then just keep frying pan. So he can't really hit that hard. And then I've got the dandelion frolicker in here. He has this little ability right here called frolic, which increases your chance to dodge by 50% for two rounds. If you go first, it's like having it in three rounds. And he also has a kick, so he can interrupt them. He doesn't hit very hard. I should really have switched to bite since I'm not going to be using this guy against an undead. But I just assumed I'd be going against more undeads than I did, so I was using scratch. They both hit for the exact same amount, so it doesn't really matter which one you choose. Uh, other than you have a better chance of going against undeads in the meta. So Scratch is usually better. But he's also a humanoid type, so you really don't want him to be going against undeads. So it's not really that big of a deal. He's also not really not that strong or that good either. I mean, he has dazzling speed and everything, but he didn't really contribute much to any of the any of the fights. He just died and didn't really hit very hard. And then I got the Frostwolf Ghost Pub in here to pretty much carry the rest of the team. He's got Haunting Song, so he pretty much single-handedly counters AoE teams. He has a Scratch, and he also hits really hard, so his Scratch actually does something. And Ghostly Bite, it hits really hard. Totally saved my ass in this one team that you'll, you'll be seeing pretty soon. Alright, so with this team here, uh, Molten Corgi, Waterfly, Untamed Hatchling, not really sure what the plan is for this guy, so I'm just gonna start off with my with my Rui Chan. Let's see, what is he gonna do? Is he gonna try to switch me out? Probably. No, looks like he went for a dot instead. Okay, looks like I got my stench up then. Um, I'm just going to switch out to be honest, because I can't really do much against this guy. He's ah. I can't really use magic card against him, so I'm gonna have to go into my into my frost wolf. Looks like he went into his puppies of the flame. Okay, I guess I'm going to go into this guy then. I'm just gonna throw up frolic, and I was able to dodge some of that. He's also got stench up for one more round. Let's just see if we can go first. Ooh, we went first. Ah, oh, it doesn't work that way. That sucks. <gasps> Let's see if I'm able to dodge any of this. No. Ah, <laughs> oh, you can't dodge crap. We have to try to take down Molten Corgi. We got this. We both have the same exact speed. You work way better against pets that you're faster than. No Dizalf. You kick doesn't work if you guys have the same speed. It makes sense in hindsight. But I mean really you never know. You never know, you know? Okay, so we got 345. I'm gonna have to go sleep bite to kill him. And here goes the bite. <gasps> oh no, I'm stunned for a round. And I'm going to have to use a Haunting Song, even if it only heals two pets. That's like 600 heal between both of us. So I'm going to pass right here. He's flying into the air. Uh, I'm going to go into my Haunting Song now. Let's hope I don't die right there. Let's heal us up a little bit. Just uh, a little bit. Um, now, how do I deal with the Waterfly? I can actually use my Parry against him. So I'm gonna switch out. What's he doing? Barbed Stinger. Okay, I'm gonna put him into a food coma and then set up stench and then frying pan. There, now he's asleep. Here comes the stench. I'm gonna see if he's gonna switch out or not. 
Ah, he switched. This works. Okay, now let's go into a frying pan. Let's see if we can get a stun. Oh, we got a stun! <laughs> That's nice. I'm just going to refresh stench. <laughs> and then I'm just going to go into a frying pan again. I'm just going to keep trying to see if I can keep him from hitting me. Because right now he has that 25% reduced chance to hit. He'll still be able to hit me. And pretty often, but not every time. Oh crap, why is this taking so long? <laughs> is he rage quitting or something? Because that would be really dumb because he has a really good chance of winning this. Maybe he's just lagging. And looks like he's throwing up barb skin. It's not really a big deal. I'm just gonna keep refreshing this and then using frying pan. Frying pan does not hit hard. Oh, <laughs> instability. <laughs> you are not gonna hit me with instability. <laughs> Not with that really ridiculously low hit chance. Okay, now we're gonna go into food coma because that's available. And then I'm gonna go into a frying pan. Oh, 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 did we get it? Did we get it? No, not really. Okay, I'm gonna go into a stench. Refresh that shit. Ah, it missed. How unfortunate. Okay, here comes frying pan again. Should be able to live this, and let's hope I get a stun. Stun, stun, stun. Yes, a stun. All right, that means I can switch into my Frost Wolf Pup and try to heal him up in the back row. Oh, looks like he switched out. Oh, he still has stench on him. That's cool. I'm gonna go into my Haunting Song to heal up my parry a little bit. And it looks like he gave me a free switch. That works out. Fine with me, actually. Okay, so I'm going to go into a ghostly bite. If I get a crit, he's dead. I really just want to get him below 50%. I am i can't really do anything, <laughs> even if he's below 50%. So let's go into Rui-chan. I've got uh, the ghostly bite off. I got the little heal on him. So let's see. He's probably going to fly into the air right now, which is a pain in the ass but uh, I don't know. Maybe he's gonna fly up right now. I really don't want to waste food coma. Food coma is not really the best thing in the world either. I'm just gonna go for a frying pan. I didn't really know what he was doing, to be honest. Okay, now I can go into a food coma. Rui-chan's gonna kick the bucket, but he still has one life. He comes back to life. There, he lives again. Now I'm going to just throw out a stench. Let's see if he goes into his untamed hatchling. Looks like he did. And I'll be able to get off one more frying pan. Let's see if I can get a stun. <gasps> oh, a stun! No way! <laughs> That's a lot of stuns. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Usually you don't take frying pan on, on parry because it's not that great. <gasps> Ooh, another stench. Okay, let's see if we can get a miss on him. Oh, oh nice! We got this. We got this. Come on, stench. We need some more. We need some more stench. Okay, that's fine. I can get off. Let's hope it misses. Yes, it missed. Oh, that's great. Oh, and it's done. Oh, oh my god. This is great. This is the greatest. Let's throw out another stench. Let's make sure they, they keep missing. Let's throw out another frying pan. Come on, let's get a stun, 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 damn it, no stun, no stun. Ah, he hit, damn it. He hit me. <laughs> what a pain in the ass. Okay, maybe I can still win this. Oh, I went first. I wasn't expecting that. I didn't know we were the same speed. Uh, I'm just, oh wait, he can't fly. He's dead. I'm gonna hit him with the scratch. Oh shit, I forgot he had that, that heal. Damn it. <laughs> Stupid add-on, why didn't you tell me he had the heal? I totally forgot he had it. I'm gonna assume he's gonna fly up in the air, so I'm gonna use my heal. And then I'm just gonna scratch him one more time. Play it safe. Actually, I could've just went for a ghostly bite too, just to rub it in, but scratch also hits for a lot because caster's pretty, pretty strong. All right, first win on this team. I wasn't expecting this team to really win much, to be honest. <laughs> Alright, looks like we're up against a really annoying team in the form of the Anubisath Idol, 
and the Emerald Proto Well. Those are going to be a huge, huge pain in the ass to kill. Uh, to be honest, I don't think I have the damage to actually kill Proto Whelp. But let's just start off with the Frost Wolf Gulf Pub, just in case he starts off with the Anubisath Idol. And looks like he's taking a while to find out which to start off with too. No, nope, looks like he went to the Idol. Okay, I'm going to go straight into Ghostly Bite and then switch into Rui-chan since Frolicler can't really hurt him. He has Scratch right now. I should probably change that out. He's not really a good choice to go against. Uh, what should we call it? Those one pads anyway. Okay, now I'm going to switch into my Rui-chan because with Sandstorm out, he'll actually be taking it worse. Oh, that was great. Why Why would he go into a deflection? Did he not know my pet was stunned? He couldn't attack that turn anyway. <laughs> oh my god. That's just the greatest. Okay, now that he's got Stench up. Um, well, now that he's got Stench, I don't know what to say about that. He just, he has a 35% less chance to hit me. Okay, I'm just going to refresh Stench. I wasn't expecting a stun right there, but a stun is, it's nice, I guess. He only has a 65% chance to hit me with his abilities, thanks to Stench and Frying Pan going out. Frying Pan, it doesn't hit hard at all. It hits for less than a basic attack. It really doesn't need that turn uh, cooldown. Okay, let's throw out another Stench. Looks like he tried to hit me with Emerald Bright and totally whiffed it. And looks like he's just going to heal up all the damage I did to him. Let's go into another Frying Pan. <laughs> And he's trying to hit me. Oh, he got a hit off. Good for you, everyone, Proto Whelp. Not sure why he went into a Proto Whelp. It, it's like literally the worst choice to go against this guy. I also can't really do much against him, to be honest. Alright, I'm going to put him to sleep just in case he tries to do anything to me. I'm also going to switch out into my Frostwolf Ghost Pup and try to kill him with a Ghostly Bite. Let's see if we can do this. Can we get the bite off on him? And kill him. I really need him dead. This hits for a little bit less than the damage I need to kill him. Ah, oh, he went into his... His... That other guy. Ugh, that sucks. Okay, I guess I'm just going to go into Magic Card then. See if I can have some fun with this guy. Oh, he's going into a heal. Ooh... That means I have to do enough damage to kill him in the turns that it takes for all this crap to go off. Which means I'm going to go into Parry and throw out a Stench. Stench! Ha 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 What are you going to do about that? And then I'm going to throw out a Food Coma and then switch back into my Dandelion fro Frolicker. Oh shit, he switched into that. Okay, let's go into Magic Card. We got this. Looks like he went into a heal. Oh, that sucks. I'm going to go into my Frolic. He's just got a heal team. Oh, I hate going against healing teams, especially since this team doesn't really have damage. Okay, it looks like he went into his Emerald Dream. Uh, okay, looks like I'm going to switch then since he's just going to start healing for no reason. Let's throw out another stench and then switch back into magic cards since this guy's straight up healing for no reason I guess he's at full health now so that that's cool good for you <laughs> okie dokes now let's go into a kick just because it hurts you a little bit more than everything else does and then let's go into a frolic that way you have an even less chance of hitting me Nope, you're just gonna keep healing, aren't you? Whatever, dude. Whatever. Oh, he hit me. That's some good luck right there. Maybe we can do this. <gasps> he hit me again. Holy shit. You don't know how hard that is to do. <laughs> this guy is way too weak to kill him, though. It's just not going to happen. We can try our best, though. Let's go for another scratch. There goes his heal. 
and I'm going to assume Emerald Dream's coming up next. So let's go into a caster. See if we can get a lucky ghostly bite. Oh, no. No Emerald Dream. Okay, I'm going to go into a scratch then and then a bite. Ghostly bite, see if I can kill him. There goes the dream. <gasps> Yay, I got him. You're dead. That does 690 damage. Oh, I'm so glad I had my Frostwolf pup. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm just going to stick on this guy and then use Haunting Song because my team has been taking some damage. Uh, he's going into his supercharge. Okay. Supercharged bite, that's not really a big deal. No, he went into a demolish. Okay. Let's go into magic card. Let's have some fun with this guy. And I'm gonna go into a frolic. Happy dance. And let's go into a kick. And then a scratch. Oh, I really need his Ancient Blessing to go away. I'm so glad I killed the proto well. This guy has too much health. Alright, let's keep going into Scratches until he dies. Aw. Oh. Aw, oh, he hit me with Demolish. That's... That's unfortunate. We should be able to kill him, though. I'm just gonna go into a Scratch and then a Ghostly Bite once he's below 700 health. There goes repair. Um, let's go into another scratch. Repair mode, and I should be able to kill him right here. Which means he's going to come back alive and then heal up for almost all his health, but that means he doesn't have his racial available to him anymore. Which is a good thing. Which means I don't really have to worry about much. He's going to go into another supercharge. Uh, if he hits with the demolish, that's a really good return on his investment. <laughs> Oh, <gasps> oh, oh my god, he hit. You have got to be kidding me. How does he keep hitting? That's, that's hacks. You can't do that. Especially not after a supercharge. Oh, you know, next time I make a 50% off team, I'm doing this. I'm doing the exact same thing he's doing. Alright, I'm going to go into a ghostly bite to try to kill him. And then I'll let Rui Chan finish him off for me. We got this Rui Chan. Go into your your frying pan. Kill him. Avenge your father your fallen brethren. That stupid cub. Okay. <laughs> We're doing good. We're doing good so far. Let's go into a stench. I literally have no reason to use food coma. All right, now he has a less chance to hit than I do. Oh, you know what? This dude did use deflection as soon as he used sandstorm. I don't think he really understands game theory. All right, I said I had no reason to use food coma, but I'm gonna do that now just so he can't hit me, and I can get off another frying pan. It missed. Oh well, 10% hit chance reduction on my side too. He has a less chance to hit. Oh, looks like he's probably gonna go into another deflection. Nope, he didn't. Damn it, I predicted incorrectly. Okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Frying pan and then stench. No need to try to predict him. Otherwise, he'll he'll wreck me a new one. He only has a 65% chance to hit. Only 65, you have to keep trying to attack. Oh, he keeps hitting. Damn him. Come on, frying pan. <laughs> you have to do this, damn it. Your deflections uh, are out of this world. <gasps> oh my god, stop missing! <laughs> There's only two misses so far. Oh, cool, we got a stun. That works. Now I can't use food coma as a backup option, but whatever. A stun is a stun. I have to just keep using frying pans off cooldown. I can't guess his deflections. Oh, damn, he hit me. This is coming down to the wire. Erg. Let's go into a stench. We need him to, to not hit. Oh, thank God he went for a deflection right there. 
Okay, come on, frying pan. Don't miss. Don't miss. And miss, 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 miss. No! <laughs> ah, that was totally in my favor, but... Uh, if I just had one of those frying pans not miss, and if I just had him miss one more of his abilities... Uh, oh, well. That was an interesting match.